Many cars on the road today are employing a feature often branded as touchless or easy entry. This entails having a key fob in your bag or pocket which acts as a wireless transmitter once it detects the car is nearby, transmitting a passcode to unlock the car. Unfortunately, criminal hackers have discovered a way to steal this code from the air and get into your car without the original key fob. It's called relay hacking. Hey guys, I'm Michael with Mission Darkness. Today, we're gonna make a DIY key fob that'll protect your car from potential break-ins with relay hacking and will protect your key fob from EMPs and EMF destruction. You can carry your key fob without worrying about its encryption keys being stolen or accidentally unlocking your car if it's nearby. Let's run down the materials you'll need to complete this project. All right, so here we have our Titan RF Faraday fabric our Titan RF one inch Faraday tape, a razor, scissors, and either a rubber band or hair tie. When it's all said and done, the final product should look something kind of like this. All right, so let's get started. So now that we have our Faraday fabric out on our working platform, we'll want to make a 12 inch by eight inch sheet. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut that real quick. And it's okay if it's not perfect. We just wanna get kinda of close to those measurements. So now that we have our working material, the first thing we'll want to do is just fold it in half. Okay, let's go ahead and crease it so it doesn't roll around anywhere. Turn it and let's fold it in half one more time. Okay, you can already start to see the shape coming out of our, of our pouch. Okay, so now we need to cut some tape. You'll want one six inch length of tape. And one four inch length of tape. And then you'll also want a couple uh, little strips of about half inch strips of tape. Now we want to take our six inch strip of Faraday tape. And we just want to place it on the side that is multi-layered. Let's go ahead and press that down. I'll flip it over, I'll fold the tape over. So now we want to take the other end and Let's take our four inch piece of tape. And let's go ahead and seal that side off. Perfect, and all I'm doing here, just overlapping the tape, folding it over. There's nothing to it. Right now is a really good time to mention that RF frequency can leak out just like water. So whenever you're making a pouch, the Faraday material, you wanna make sure that you seal all corners and all holes. Now, so we're gonna go ahead and take this little piece of extra tape that I cut off, and let's patch it up just to make sure that we get that full seal. So we're just gonna take our fabric, our new tape, and put it right over the edge here, flip it over. Next, let's connect our rubber band. So now I'm gonna take one of our half inch pieces of tape. We'll just put one end on the bottom, and we'll put our, flip it over. We'll put our rubber band right on top of the tape, and then we'll fold it over. Perfect. Just like that. So basically, our rubber band is gonna be used to actually wrap up our Faraday pouch. But we're gonna go ahead and add a key ring as well that you can use to hang it up when it's all wrapped up. So let's go ahead and take our second piece of five inch tape. And we're gonna do the same thing as before, except for in the corner. All right, we're just gonna take our key ring, 
put it right on top of the tea. And then fold the tape through, just like before. Perfect. Look at that. A Faraday pouch for your key fobs. It's just that easy. So let's try it out and see if it actually works. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put my key fobs in here. We're just gonna roll the top. Roll it down until all the space has been taken out of the pouch. And then we'll take our rubber band and just fold it over like that. You can even layer it multiple times if you want it to be held tighter. Just like that. Now you can even hang it up. So an added benefit of having this key ring on here is if you remove your rubber band, you take your keys out, and you roll up your key fob pouch, you can fold it up really small and hook it on your key rings. So you have it wherever you go. Now, if you're not so much of a do-it-yourselfer, we do offer a line of products available on our website. We have the Mission Darkness Key Fob Bag. It's pre-made, ready to go. Um, this one doesn't have a key ring, but it does have a belt loop, so you can actually hook it onto your belt. Not only do we have the key fob bag, but we also have the Blockstar key fob pouch. Not only does this protect your devices from EMFs, but it's also very handy. All right, guys, I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment your questions below. Follow us on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram, and go ahead and tag us at Mission Darkness if you make something cool so we can see what you came up with. All right, guys, see you in the next video.